show you how you can use your IntelliJ data browser to connect to your Apache Geode cluster or Apache Genfire cluster using uh, SQL over GDBC. I have uh, prepared a local cluster running here. Let's connect to it and explore what is the content list regions. We have a couple of regions pre-created. Okay, we have a few entries in the bookmaster region. Now let's see how we can access this from within uh, IntelliJs. First, we need to register the um, GOT GDBC driver. There is a project Apache outside GOT that uh, I've been working on on implementing such a driver. Let's create a connection to this one. First thing is we have to provide the jar. I have a fresh build here. Let's call it geot driver. Select the right class path. Employee default uh, GDBC uh, URL site model, which is file. So the parameterization of the driver head comes from a file, JSON file that we have to provide. Um, and it looks like this. Actually, I'm going to use this particular one that tells uh, uh, the adapter how to connect to our uh, geode cluster using the locators, coordinates, and which regions should be exposed as a uh, relational tables. Okay, let's go ahead and create connection. Let's specify the JSON find that I just just showed you. bunch of those in the resources here this was the one let's use it and connect okay connection successful and we see exactly the same regions exposed as a tables here furthermore we can now leverage the nice interface provided by uh, the data browser here can even go and check the content like this or perform let's pretend we are postgres dialect select everything from test bookmaster okay here is the results let's make it a little bit more interesting group by Uh, year of publishing it and show the of course the year of publishing the group by parameter and some of retail costs here it is one step further we can even explain plan for this query using the GDBC, this is the physical implementation or you can check the without so this is the logical plan as CodeSite provides you can do much more in the future I'll demonstrate this